Shalom everyone, a huge support to have Rabbi Joey Rosenfeld, who uh, educates people against addictions, who's a top therapist here in the city of Bet Shemesh, and he has his own website also. Uh, he, he will speak about it, and a uh, huge support to have some words of wisdom from him. Sure. Hi, Shalom Aleichem everybody. Um, it's a pleasure to be here. It's supposed to be here. So we're coming into the time of Purim, which is a day of celebration, a day of joy, and a day of coming to a place of recognizing that really what we thought we knew about reality, what we thought knew about other people or about ourselves is very often upside down, topsy-turvy to what we really expected. It's a day where we allow ourselves to be proven wrong by the fact that we don't have as much control as we thought we had, we don't know as much as we thought we knew, and typically that leads to a state of anxiety, it leads to a state of struggling to try and know, but on Purim, HaKadosh Baruch Hu, God gives us permission to live in the comfort of not knowing, in the comfort of realizing, I don't know, but I certainly have the ability to have faith, which is what happens when a person realizes that they don't know. On Purim, when a person doesn't know, when we look at the parts of ourselves that don't know, that we don't know, that we don't understand the parts of others, that we don't understand the parts of God, the world that we don't understand, instead of being stuck in a despondent place of sadness, we can open ourselves up to the belief, the, the faith that things are good in spite of the fact that we don't know how, and that's where the Simcha of Purim comes from. It's the ability to let go of the ability of knowing completely and to live with the joy of this moment, Bezra Hashem. You can find some of my shirim on joeyrosenfeld.com and a freilich in Purim Everybody. Amen.